That's what you don't want to do when people come up on a table, okay? This is also, we're doing the notepad, the pen drop, uh, the notepad, you're trying to get Phil or whatever guest, come on over, I'm Larry, uh, this is Seth, and Seth will give you some more information about Second Stage Premiums. Drop it, it is critical. When you're the anchor, and those are the two uh, point, that's running the point. Three people in a booth, nobody ever sits. Two people running the point, funnel into the closer, okay? That's the anchor, the closer. So it's point people, closers. When the booth is slow, two people at the point, try to make the yellow zone expand. When it's really busy, people will naturally herd. So you're gonna have two closers and just one point person. Or if it's dead and the red zone's micro tiny, it's three people running the point, one person closing. No people closing, you don't have to close. So the closer then comes from one of the three point people when it's dead, slow, dying. I actually hate the South by Booth because I don't love that trade show thing, but there's two events that are on Thursday that I, fingers crossed, am trying to get tables for. One is at Startup Crawl, and the other one is at Molotov, which is Austin Tech Cocktail. Two demo tables, same way. Closer, point. And then you're doing tag team selling. When you're sneaking up on a person, okay, before when I was, I was kind of joking, but I wasn't. When you're, when you're approaching, if I'm approaching you, okay, I want to tap you from the side, allow you a profile, and then say hi. So what I'm trying to do is I'm not, I'm not, I'm trying not to just tap you on the back of the shoulder where you have to turn around and all of a sudden there's my face. I want to tap, tap you, tap you, tap you, tap you, tap you, tap you. Oh, there you are. So that way you, I, I don't surprise you, you surprise me, even though I'm the one initiating that contact. That kind of wedging in and networking is going to happen all the time at South By. There's going to be, especially VIPs, okay, and this is how to wedge in on a VIP conversation. A VIP, like Ben Horowitz, who loves you, Ben, is going to be probably surrounded by throngs of people on that Sunday, uh, March 9th at 3.30. Creepy, isn't it? Ben will be surrounded. I will be wedging you in, okay, with my badge that says Get Chitter, that, I know, I just verbally committed to you guys. You can wedge in by staying silent and then waiting, okay, because they're going to be locked in like five girls on a dance floor. You know how they go, they're, they're like, oh, don't, and it's so creepy when dudes come behind and grind. Okay, anyway, that's not me. I approach from the side. And then I wait for a Ben Horowitz to slightly turn. This is what every VIP does. They all do that. You got that? So if, if you're wedging in, and I've got my people right here, this is what every VIP does. They do one finger up in the air, and then they wink. And that's to let you know that you're on deck. Now, we're going to be doing a lot of networking together, but I never want to see a rock pile where it's two or more people from the same team that are gathered and only talking. It's hard to break into that rock pile, just like the five person. We ourselves, we never rock pile. The majority of our walking around and networking and collecting leads for uh, the war room, which I will control, that is best done when you're networking and cold calling alone. Okay, that's why you've got the, the, the Nike jersey, even though uh, I'm wearing Under Armour right now. Feels like I'm kind of cheating a little bit. Feels good. Monogamy. Monogamy, I define as hanging out with just five people. Right, girlfriend? See? Yeah. No girlfriend. I have a girlfriend. She just doesn't want to talk to me. Walking around and collecting as many leads as possible, and the best way to do that is absolutely, is absolutely to network and cold call and collect leads on your own and circulate yourself. I know it's a bit of a challenge to do that. Massively helpful. Carry your, not your clipboard, okay, but carry your, what they don't, what they will never teach you at Stanford Business School about EU, TWM, PPM at South by Southwest. Carry that notebook around 
constantly because that'll be a conversation starter um, and you can even sell copies of that book. You bought it for seven, eight, nine bucks and that's the arbitrage. You buy it for less than 10 with shipping and you sell it for 150 bucks and that book comes out 11-11-2014 and in the same way that you had to go through 11 little loopholes to, to, to activate that and upload pictures using second stage premiums, using initial stage premiums. That's the same thing that you're going to be doing for your guys' companies. If you've got questions, reach out to me at 650-283-8008, 650-283-8008. It's Larry at duck9.com. And something that is going to come up too is people are going to ask, is, is Larry a founder of, because I'm going to promote and work it as if I am. Well, I want to be promoting so, and that's a complimentary question. And people are actually, what, as a compliment to you, they will ask you, oh, are you a founder? Uh, always just be 